Hi, I'm Gwendolyn. And I'm Joey! <laughs> yeah. And this is our first YouTube video to be posted. Ever. That's why we're introducing ourselves. We, we yeah. like Minecraft videos. That's what, that's what introduced us to YouTube, basically. This is what know. our video is about. With the clothespin gun. It's amazing. Yes. All you need is an ordinary clothespin. Yeah. A rubber band or something to go around this part right here. Or a hair tie or something. And also something to cut with. Which is pretty strong scissors here. Yes. Okay. You Kids, do not try this at home. Or do. We we are double digits, nine and under. No. -uh. <laughs> no. 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 -uh. Yeah. No. Okay. No. Anyway, start with the clothespin and take it apart like so. Take the spring off. Yeah. Then you would cut this part <coughs> right here, this part with a little notch off, just right down the middle with your scissors. Double digits only! Which I'm not going to do right now because I've already made one. So you're going to have Ooh. this part left over. Put this aside because we're going to need that. Anyway. And then, so you have that much left. And take the other one. Just put a little notch right where you cut it on the other one. Right here. Put it right here. So that the springy part springy part, can go right in here, like, and rest there, right there. Okay, now that you've done that, what you do is this. You take them like this, you take them like this, you have your two pieces, you put them together, just like that, so the two little squares here are matching <coughs> each other. You can see through them. You take the springy part, this is a little bit tricky, mm -hmm. and you put it, apply apply it to this area. Well, first you will need to put the rubber band on, like so, right, right around here. Like this. Just keep on tying it until it just holds it together. It keeps it until all it has to do is hold it together. It doesn't have to be super tight or anything. Just to hold it together so you can lift this part. If you like Star Wars, I'm your man. I'm in for property. Still, I even got the same color cloak. Yeah. Yeah. So that you can lift this piece up, but it still stays together. Put it upside down, still together. And then you would apply the, the spring. Take it like this, take the spring, so that it's not bending the way it really wants to bend, and just put it on there, like so. So that this area, this part right here, fits into the notch right there. And this part goes underneath the smaller piece right here. So now, to cock the gun, you take this piece, pull it over, and then pull the spring over like so. What's this? The ancient fountain of lava. Now you have what looks like a gun. This part is very loaded, so, yeah. There's no safety on this thing. Now you would take the piece that you cut off earlier, right here, and stick it into the slot here underneath. You might want to push it a little, a little and make the top slightly behind the bottom, like that. See that? Okay. Now you're ready to shoot it. You hold it like this and just pull it like a regular trigger on a regular gun. Like that. Let's see what happens. Three, two, one. And it's gone.
You can also shoot toothpicks. Sometimes it doesn't really work, so you might want to get a toothpick that's slightly bigger and wider than the second toothpick. You can't really tell. But yeah. You recock the gun first, like so. And then load it with your two toothpicks. And if they aren't the same size, then only one of them will fire. So don't expect them both to fire off. But you can shoot these. Just watch. Three, two, one. Oh, and they both went. That's cool. Anyway, yeah, pretty cool thing. Recock it. Yes. Make sure that little spring goes down into the bottom uh, of this square here, see. right in the middle, right there, right here. Uh, yeah. So there's your clothespin gun. Have fun. Oh yeah, we're good.